Well, did you know that today is Utility Scam Awareness Day? A real good reminder that utility scams are unfortunately common, but they are good ways, and there are good ways to protect yourself. So joining us with how you can do that, we have Simply Money's Amy Wagner. Good morning. Good morning. So Duke Energy, obviously, yeah. has a huge presence around here, is one of the founding members of a group called Utilities Against Scams. And so far, they this is just like in a few years' time, shut down 2,200 toll-free numbers that people wow. are using to call people and perpetuate these scams. And here's how it works. You get a call, so think about how cold it is out right yeah. now. Mm -hmm. You get a call from someone sounding very forceful, saying they are from Duke Energy or from a utility company, saying that their your power is going to be turned off, that you owe a lot of money, and you can give your credit card number, of course, right now, yeah. uh, and everything will be fine. In some cases, they ask for a prepaid debit card. And mm -hmm. as much as you think I wouldn't fall for that, there are a number of people out there who do. It's cold out. You can't yeah. imagine going without your heat right now. Uh, maybe you do have a bit of a balance. This person sounds very forceful. They, you think they are from the company. And a lot of times they can spoof the numbers. So it might oh, come wow. up on your caller ID as something that looks like it could be Duke Energy. It could even say Duke Energy. So in so many cases, it looks like it could be legit. It looks real. Yes. So how many people actually fall victim to this? So they've taken 25,000 reports yeah. since this started in 2015 from people who say, I've gotten calls like this. Five to seven percent of people actually fall for this. It's a numbers game. Okay. The more you call, the, the more, more you're going to have victims. Absolutely. Yeah. In, in total. They fell for more than $1.5 million just so far. So these are perpetuated constantly. These scammers are getting smarter and smarter. They're coming up with more and more ways to do this. Yeah, so what are some other utility scams out there that we should be aware of? Another one that they'll often call about is they'll say, you know what, we can actually wipe out the balance of your account. We just need a one-time cash fee. So maybe you've been carrying yeah. month to month. Maybe you've got, you know, several hundred, maybe a thousand dollars racked up for this one-time fee, right? Give me your credit card number right now, we can wipe this out. That will never happen. A utilities company is never going to just wipe out the balance mm. for a fee unless you pay that all. What about you hear reports of people showing up to folks' homes saying they're with that company? I think that's the scariest of all. Scary. Whether it's utilities, whether it's a satellite company, they have to check a meter, they have to check something in your house. Of course, what they want is access to your house and everything in it. Yeah. Through the years, I've covered so many people who have fallen prey to this, and you, be, you be, feel like such a, when they're physically in your home, they have taken your things, yeah. uh, you have to ask questions. You can keep that person at the door, you can ask to see their credentials, and then call the company and say, check. yeah, hey, satellite company, would someone be coming to, I need to make sure, yeah. verify before you let anyone in your home ever, unless you've been notified before yeah. in a way that is legitimate, but it never hurts to call the company. Yeah. And it stinks that we're in a place where we have to do Be that. so much on guard. Absolutely, yeah. but we do. Yeah, I think that's very good advice to protect ourselves. You never know, right? You never know. Tip of the week? Tip of the week is, as we start getting into this holiday season, one good way to save money on that shopping is to use discounted gift cards. There's sites like Raise uh, that you can go to, and they've got great uh, coupons or, or great gift cards on there right now. Under Armour, North Face, Nike, all marked down 8% or so. Maybe if you've got kids to buy for, Build-A-Bear Workshop, $25 gift cards, you pay just $18. Really? So you can either give the gift cards or use them to buy things yourself.